Hey everybody. Um, so I just wanted to do a really quick review. Um, I was on Instagram and I saw this offer for like a free photo book and they were giving a certain amount of people a $150 voucher um, to get a photo book sent to them. And then basically you just give a review or you just um, do a hashtag or something. So I haven't got the chance to do it, but right now I guess I could do it real quick. I have some, uh, m a couple minutes, you know? So anyways, so I went ahead and tried to um, choose the pictures I wanted them to use from like this past like summer, you know? And basically like a lot of times I had to resize them, I noticed, um, and I really didn't have the time to because it didn't save it. And I really didn't have time to resize it. So a lot of them were cut off. So I just thought I did it um, essentially for them to kind of resize. I'm really not sure where they sent it from, but I think it was from like the UK or something. Nonetheless, I got this really cool photo book and I'm going to review it. Um, I did already look at it, but I will show it again. So, um, this is how it looks. It's a nice hard cover and it has nice binding and everything. And it's like this. So this was like $150. Um, and I never removed this, so I'm going to remove it right now. It's like, um, you know, they put, I guess I made it for them to choose what photos to use. Um, I'm taking the film off the front cover however, and it's kind of stuck on it. Um, stuck on it. Oh, I don't know. It is stuck on it. Like, what the heck? Ah, and my face, like, appears. See? But, yeah, so you just have to take this film off, and it's taking a while, so I don't know if I want to mess around with it too much. Um, but like I said, this is a $150 voucher and basically I got this photo book for free. So I'm not going to complain, you know, it's pretty cool, but, um, I'll show you how it looks inside. It's called Sal Digital, S-A-A-L. Um, I should have had this taken off beforehand. Sorry. Uh, so you get to choose the photos and whatnot and... Uh, you know, what kind of design, I guess you could put cool, like, wedding photos or whatever you want to do, but I'm going to show you what I got. I'll just mess with that later, but I'll just th toss that pan and that ham in the frying pan. Anyways, so this is the front cover. I don't know if they, they chose this, a selfie of me. How obscure. So, oh, sorry. Um. It's pretty thick, like the, like the, whatever. And I chose a bunch of pictures from my Instagram or whatever was saved. And it's just pictures of me. <laughs> no, it's like my Instagram photos. Somebody did that, it's an app and they sent me it and I was like, I'll just choose that, okay. That was at Bushkill Park in Pennsylvania. Um, Bushkill Park is a very, like, cool place. If you Google it, you'll see. There's Sherry. Um, there's Sarah and Sherry. There is me. And see, so they cut it off. We we went to his work. He's a truck He's a truck driver. But anyways, those are, that's the first page. And the second page. And it's pretty thick pages. And it's a really glossy finish, like. So this is our friend Tommy, my our friend Tommy that passed away in May, and I wanted to like put pictures of him up, you know, but um, they cut his face off because I made him paint a painting the one time. They unfortunately they cut his face off, so that's really lame. Here's some more photos, um, just like basic stuff, but they cut. I mean, they cut a lot of the photos off, and they made them really small, so you can't really see 
too much. It doesn't really have a scent to it. But I didn't know what to choose. I don't even know what this photo is. Like, what the heck? Look at that one. This is just stupid. Like, what is that? Like, I don't know what that is. There's Tommy, though. The, the one that we said that passed away. There's Sarah. Um, that was at one of my picnics I had. <laughs> See, they cut photos off, so. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's cool that I have this, but. You know, and the, these are photos are really tiny, as you can see. Um, yeah, these are just pictures that I posted on Instagram, anyways. And look, we saw the fireworks, but a tree was in front of it. But that's not a good enough photo for a eight by ten or whatever this size is. And that's the photo, I guess. I keep smelling the book. <laughs> um that they used you know but it's cool i guess memories of the summer and here's my picnic i had right there thousand dollar uh that was um a back to the future type of thing that's marble there's a marble just like photos, Instagram photos, you know. Bushkill Park, me and Sherry, you know. Um, stuff like that. I'll just show you the pictures. I love the sunset. I took so many pictures of the sunset because I just love the sunset. And I have a lot of selfies because and I painted like my my living room, you know, me and Jai did. Um, it's just photos of the summer, basically. Um you know there's Jai. <laughs> they cut it off and just I don't know. There's Lila. She, I, I remember when I took that photo, I was wondering what she was staring intently at. And I'm like, what, what is she just staring at? She's staring at a bee, like, on the flower. There is Phyllis, who I don't talk to anymore because she's, like, she hates me now. My neighbor, I don't know, whatever. Um, more. I mean, you can see that, like, it's just... It, I didn't know what p photos to take, but I only had a day left, so I just chose what. Actually, I think I was late, so I just chose whatever. And they took a real big picture of me and Phyllis. <laughs> so, I don't know. Um, so, they cut off pictures, you know? Like this? What the hell? So, they don't really look at what they're... Unless you're supposed to do it all yourself, but it's okay. I'm just... Whatever. Um, yeah, I took so many sunset photos, which I still do when I have a chance. It's just, like, pictures from, you know, pictures. <laughs> That's all. Photos. And I have so many, I have a couple of videos that I'd like to upload. I just never get around to doing it. Me and Sarah, you know, we took, um... I don't really know why I took these pictures either. I just chose whatever, you know. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's nothing existential, you know what I mean? Looks like it's a lot of the same pictures, actually. Oh, oh my god, it looked creepy there. I remember that. It was at the Phillipsburg Mall. Like, early in the morning. But it was a cool day. Like, these are definitely memories that I will know. I mean, I know. Um, and then the last one. Hmm. Very interesting. Um, but I actually would prefer just to uh, go to 
walmart.com and just print out my own photos and put them away in a photo book myself. I love pictures lately. I haven't really been doing anything and it's kind of depressing and I feel like I'm at a point, point in my life where it's like things happened. I know my glasses are uneven. I don't really do videos anymore, so. Um, but I did want to do this review. Like I said, it cuts off the photos and stuff. So I would actually just print out my own pictures and put them in a photo album. But it's kind of cool to have this like thing here, you know? Yeah, it's snapshots of what happened during summer 2022. So, and you know, so much, I've been through so much. I haven't like been recording or talking about it or even stopping to think about what's been going on, but a lot has been going on. I really would like to have a chance just to sit down and actually, like, just uh, for my own sake, just to note down, like, things that have occurred because, like, so much has, you know, and I'm now at this point where I just realize that, like, uh, like, we're energy, like, pretty much, like, contained, you know, like, in this body that we decide to um proclaim <laughs> but uh you know i'll try to get back to making videos <laughs> or whatever i mean not like i'm not like it's that big of a deal but anyways this is sol digi digital s-a-a-l uh, i gotta go because dry's calling me right now so i gotta go Unless I was cut off already.